cold outside. All right, solar panels. <clears throat> I got is a 100 amp hour AGM battery. Fuse block. Runs up. Goes to the controller. Eight gauge wire. Also down to my distribution blocks. Another fuse block. And I got distribution block for positive and negative. Right now I've just got one light hooked up. Then I got my solar panels that I've got to mount. Now I found out that my trailer is not square. I set my solar panel on top and it's off. So I'm just going to set it the best I can, drill some holes, um, glue this thing down with some like a uh, um, construction adhesive. Hope for the best. I also have to drill a hole in the in the, in the roof and um, run my wires down and silicone that up. So see what happens. Okay. My my wiring is here. I want to put a hole somewhere around in here. So I want to lift this up. Okay. I measured 11 inches by 3 inches. So 11 inches this way. Put us here. Three inches in. Put this here. I'm going to four. That height will be fine. Made marks. Basically, it's going to set like that, and then I'll bolt to the bracket. The other camera died, so anyway, um, I've got these brackets mounted. They're not mounted to the trailer. There's one around the edge, and then uh, I got this power grab, ultimate all-weather Loctite stuff. So what I'm going to do is mark where it's setting. To shoot this with the phone but I just laid a bead down and we'll let a bead down the other side and then we're gonna set this on top. The camera died but you can see it's glued up screwed in place screwed in place glued up on the other side and I'm hoping that these three screws and the screw around there and the construction glue will be enough to hold it. I mean, it should. And then the inside, there's a pipe coming down. There's the two connectors with my wire added and put into the panel. And as you can see, power is flowing in and a happy, happy battery. All right, that's the solar panels.